Hello, everybody and sports fans out there in the world. This is the Atlanta Halucha's owner, Fizzy Stardust, and I am taking on Swagalith's team, the Pittsburgh Steelix. And he's going to lead off with a Reggie Rock, which is cool. Uh, I lead off with a Mew. I feel pretty good about it. I have a Grass Knot on Mew, so I'm going to just probably just going to go right ahead for that. Um, he's going to switch into Porygon Z. Take that grass knot and take it pretty well. Uh, actually, really, 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 really well. Now, I'm going to bring in um, this dude. Uh, he can take a special attack or two, and, especially from Porygon, too. Um, I'm also have knockoff, so knockoff is legit. Um, I, you know, would rather Porygon 2 not have its item. Knockoff, strong move. I like knockoff. Knockoff this Regirock because it came in. I'm going to go ahead and taunt it because I expect some sort of status. He does go for Thunder Wave and I feel pretty smart. <laughs> now I'm going to switch out into Aerodactyl because the thing I want most in this Yo, world is... Yo, unnerve Aerodactyl. Yeah, dude. Yeah, Steve. It's unnerve Aerodactyl. So I'm going to try and set up rocks on a switch here. He's going to go into Toxic Croak, uh, which is fine. Uh, if I did go for Earthquake there, that would have been cool. Uh, but I'm going to go for Earthquake here on this uh, Regirock. Uh, and I do an okay amount. I'm going to go ahead and do it again. Um, the Regirock is a beast, and I want to give as much damage on it as I can. He gets his own rocks off. So I'm just going to Earthquake again as he switches out into Landorus Eye, which doesn't take anything from the Earthquake. And I finally get my rocks up. I think I just saw uh, Joe with an Air Balloon Landorus. No, you saw the, the I'm stones pretty sure I just saw around. that. i got to see it. No, I gotta no, 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 Steve. That was just the Stealth Rocks. Now, uh, he does end up taking me out uh, with uh, Psychic. As I'm going to go to Keldeo, scare this thing out, uh, I could go for a strong water move here, and that'd be nice. Now, he goes into Slowbro. <sighs> or Slow King, sorry. I go for the Icy Wind uh, to ensure, A, that I didn't miss on the Landorus, or B, if he brought in something that was uh, some fast or scarfed or something, I would slow it down. Uh, because, you know, that would have been cool. I'm going to switch into Drapey on here on this guy, who's going to take a Thunder Wave just fine. Um, I am going to be able to scare it away with a knockoff. Uh, it's definitely not going to take... It's just not going to take a stab knockoff. Um, it doesn't want to take one. doesn't want to feel it. doesn't want to do anything. It doesn't have anything to do with it, man. I swear to you, yes. Now, uh, he does bring in Regirock on the Switch. I knock it off. Uh, it doesn't quite knock it out. Um, I feel confident in my ability to take a rock slide and not get paralyzed or flinched, <laughs> and then I knock off it again. Um, so that will be cool. That would be great. Now, he's going to bring Landers. I am not going to switch out, you know, uh, Drapion. You're just done, man. I don't want to switch anything into those Earth Power. It's dangerous to go out there alone. Here, take this. It's a Keldeo. Keldeo. Uh, I could go for the Icy Wind again. Um, you know, I can kind of expect um, Slow King to come back out. So I went for Hydro Pump. It's going to do a little bit more damage considering it's stab. Very, very powerful. Now, uh, I cannot touch Slow King. I can, I cannot. Um, so, but Mew can, Mew's great, and if he decides to status me, I have Synchronize. Now, it's not the status that I would have wanted Mew to take, I would have rather it been Toxic, and that way his Slow King would also be Toxic, but I will take the Para chance. He will bring in the Porygon 2, Porygon 2 takes some damage from that, and, uh, you know, I'm gonna go for Psy Shock, uh, actually predicting a switch. Um, it does some damage to Porygon 2, but not quite enough. Um, and I'm going to try Aura Sphere at this point, and it doesn't do very much either. I mean, I really can't put much onto this Porygon 2. So I'm going to switch out into Keldeo, it's got a stab fighting move. Um, and I do take a Tri-Attack pretty well, man. Um, I feel good about it. I feel good about that Tri-Attack. I feel good about just, uh, you know, hauling off and hitting something with the Secret Sword. Secret Sword is going to hit in this uh, Slow King, which does an okay amount, uh, considering it's a Slow King and a Resist and all that jazz. Now, I do have to switch out, and the obvious switch uh, for me right now is Mew. Uh, uh, it's the only thing that I can feel like I could bring in on this thing, and then uh, like feel safe bringing something in, and then uh, threaten it out. 
So now Porygon 2 is uh, obviously coming out, but I thought that maybe it was a tad too obvious and went for the grass knot. Uh, but no, <laughs> it was just a smart play. Uh, now I'm going to bring in Chandelure here and trying to uh, spook him a little. Substitute Porygon 2. Oh my god. Yeah, and Steve. Fucking... Sub. I'm going to sub up 2, actually. Chandelure with Infiltrator. Yeah, I mean, that's what I wanted him to think. Ooh, maybe I have him, maybe I don't, I don't know. Oh, we got, we got recover up. Actually, yep, he just flat out switched out of a Porygon 2 behind a sub. You're damn straight he did. Uh, but I'm going to resub Chandler here. Chandelure resubbed. Oh my god, how did that... They, what, what is happening in this game? Steve, I need to resub in case Steve, I want to scout his moves. Why on earth switch out? Uh, that's a secret. So I'm going to switch into Dragonite because I feel Earth Power coming, and now I'm going to double switch out and triple switch. I don't know. Double switch into Keldeo. He's going to take a sludge wave um, and then die. Poor little pony. Mew comes back in after rocks and after Landorus being a beast. Earth Power will take out Mew, poor little guy. Yeah, right now, Landorus' eyes is going ham. He most certainly is, Steve. Now, I bring in Chandelure because... Fire Blast. Fire Blast is right, Yo, Steve. Stay in? Unless he just scarfs Chandelure with sub. Damn straight I am. Damn effing straight. Got the little some spooky action going. Oh, got... Chandelure's Flash Fire the whole time. Yes, it does. Use fire Blast on the thing that just traced Flash Fire. And there's a reason I did that, Steve. I wanted to scout out its move pool. I wanted to see what else it would do besides try attack. I mean, he try attacked me. He expected the switch. Oh, oh man. Joe missed a Toxic on Dragonite. And it was a pretty sizable miss. I am running Lumberry, but uh, we have no way of telling if it will actually uh you know, come into play later. I take that try attack as well as I need to, and I go for the plus one outrage. And then I proceed to do it again. So I'm an outrage on this scolipede, knocking out this scolipede. And it takes a, a little uh, baby bye. Montel the slow king. That's what comes out next. And not take a plus one outrage. From no, it can't, Steve. No, it can't. It's going to get uh, fainted super hard. And then my Lumberry. Oh, actually, that missed Toxic might have like, hurt him. I don't know. It, it very well. Cured his, that was whatever. Yes, Lumberry, Steve. Uh, yeah, that Toxic very well could have mattered. I also could have broke out of Confusion. Uh, but we don't know. Is Pokemon is a game of numbers and how they generate randomly. So I'm going to say a good game to Joe, even though I hate his guts. I still like the guy. So uh, rate, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys next week with another GBA match. Blah, blah, blah. Bye.